it's about 10 10 in the morning something like that look at that where where's it say where's where's the sign there you go producer's dairy it's where i work uh i've been working since yesterday at uh 11 30 at night so um all i ate yesterday was like a soup that i took and uh a bunch of water so right now i'm eating my real medley uh quaker oatmeal on the way home i'm probably gonna catch some z's and then get up and go teach uh gotta find my car but get up and go teach and then uh back to work again so i'm in the car now driving home actually in napa now so um probably work about maybe 15 20 minutes away from my house maybe 25 depends on traffic um but the hardest part about this whole prep for state championships has really been my, my weight and that it always actually is a problem for me or is a challenge i would say for me because um i don't think anyone would understand unless they work graveyard shift <clears throat> but i never know when my day really starts um when I first started working, uh, where I'm working right now, um, I I was eating a lot. So I gained a lot of weight real, real fast because I would eat on my break at work, which is about maybe 1 or 2 a.m. Then I eat on my lunch, which is about 4.30 or 5. Um, not to say I would eat anything really bad, but I would eat, you know. And I'd get off at 10 a.m., go home. You know, that's breakfast at home already for them have just woken up so maybe I eat something there I go to sleep for a couple of hours I wake up I eat lunch you know, a normal person's lunch right um, around midnight or around noon or one or something like that then I go teach I come back I eat dinner right so I'm really really what I was doing was eating almost every three hours you know um, like non-stop I wouldn't you know no sleeping really I mean you know when you really fast when you sleep because you're asleep for anywhere from like what six to eight hours something like that so you're fasting you're not eating right I didn't have that because I was only eating about maybe I was only sleeping about maybe I don't know three or four hours a day so I had to figure out when I was gonna eat and when I wasn't gonna eat so I try not to eat that much when I'm at work um, just like on my lunch and then I try and actually sleep if I can on my uh, other breaks um, or, you know, switch it up. You know, maybe I'll eat on my first break and sleep on my lunch or something like that. Um, but, yeah, that's always the hard part. But now now I'm kind of getting the hang of it. And um, uh, I'm going to see what I weigh in right now when I get home. <clears throat> Yesterday when I, um, when I got up, I was 182. So... You know, very close. I think it's uh, what uh, six pounds off. Um, should be able to make it there. I think in my video yesterday I said that it's two weeks away to state championships. It's actually three, so that gives me an extra week. Um, that for some reason uh, my mind wasn't wasn't thinking right, but um, extra week to lose the weight and extra week to train. So I'm um, pretty happy about that. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna put gas right now. Go home and then probably um, go to sleep. And uh, hopefully I'll get at least, if I can, three hours of sleep. If I can, that'd be great. So we'll see. But I'll probably check in when I get back to the school. When I get to start teaching, right before I start teaching. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. So I'm back at home now, but like I said, I'm still hungry. Um, all I had was uh, a soup at like 2 or 3 in the morning. Then I ate that uh, oatmeal on the way home. So I think I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get myself one of these uh, sandwich, healthy multigrain sandwiches. They're 100, uh, 100 calories. And then uh, probably get some egg whites, uh, some avocado, and just a little bit of ketchup. And probably some cheese. I think I have some 30 calorie uh, Swiss cheese. So I'll show you a picture when it's done. Maybe some lettuce mm -mm -mm. and some water. Product. Boom right there. Pretty much what I ate yesterday, except I had a turkey burger. But that's gonna be today. So we get some water to go down with this, and that's breakfast.
Hey, so I'm at the school. It's 4:10. Class is about to start in about five minutes. Uh, this week is promotion week, so we have most students testing for stripes. Uh, a couple testing for belts, but mostly for stripes. So, um, so yeah, I'm gonna start that off today, and then uh, get some training in this afternoon. And uh, I'm gonna try to record. I always say I'm gonna try to record some, but I never end up doing it. But I'm gonna try really hard to get this one. So, um, so yeah. So we'll see you guys in a minute. I'm about to start class and get ready. Just got done teaching. 6.37 on my way home. Um, work out the workout course. I didn't record anything like I normally do. I always say I'm going to, but I never get a chance to. Um, but my my goal is sometime in these vlogs, at some point to record even a little bit of me training so um, or the team training. So it was good today though. I got a good workout, um, sweat a bunch, got conditioning in. Um, Thanks to my friend, uh, Mr. Garcia, who owns a school also in Fairfield, who came and um, he didn't train today. He just just held for me, which was awesome. Um, it's it's cool when you have somebody that's able to to come and help you, you know, um, just to help you, you know. So that that's that's awesome. Um, but yeah, I'm about to come home, or about I'm home now, and um, I'm gonna make a turkey burger and uh, with some sweet potato fries. So I'm gonna show you that. Um, it's gonna be really good. Just watch and then uh, hang out with the family. And then go to sleep, go to work again. So um, tomorrow I'm gonna, I'm gonna take I'm gonna go through the whole day, from when I wake up from my nap at night, to to see what you so you guys can see what I go through every day. It's pretty pretty intense. Don't really sleep much, which which isn't the best, but you gotta make it work because the bills don't stop. 